Samsung may introduce an iOS 18-inspired media player UI to the One UI 7 lock screen. This significant redesign could replace the current layout with a larger, more prominent interface expected to roll out to Galaxy devices early next year. According to Tipster Ice Universe, One UI 7 might feature an overhauled lock screen media player UI with the current style replaced by a fresh design. It may take cues from iOS 18, occupying a larger area on the lock screen. The new lock screen media player in One UI 7 could showcase a large square thumbnail with a track progress bar and controls in a separate overlay. A refined blur effect could add an appealing touch to the redesigned interface. Many Galaxy fans have long wanted an iOS-style interface, and it seems Samsung aims to deliver with substantial design updates in One UI 7. We've already heard about updates to the quick settings and notification panel. Alongside the new media player UI, One UI 7 will introduce redesigned quick settings and a revamped notification panel. Samsung is also implementing functional improvements to enhance the overall user experience. Samsung's developers are working on smoother animations, aiming to achieve a level of fluidity similar to Apple's iOS. Well-known tips or Ice Universe at Universe share that the One UI 7.0 beta update may need another two weeks before release. Ice Universe also stated that the latest internal beta build with firmware ending in XJVU Vivo is packed with features and highly flexible, making it notably better than previous leaks. For the first time in recent years, Samsung hasn't released a better version of One UI by November. In previous years, stable One UI updates were typically available for high-end and some mid-range models by this time. This year, Samsung has announced that the One UI 7.0 beta will arrive by year's end, with a stable release likely in early 2025. Samsung is expected to limit the beta launch to seven countries, China, Germany, India, Poland, South Korea, the United Kingdom, and the United States. Expanding the beta to more regions has long been a priority request from Samsung users. A wider beta program would allow Samsung to collect feedback from an even larger user base, though it's almost unlikely this year. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.